Y'all, it's your boy EQ. What's going on, bang? Hey, um, just got done doing what I always wanted to do. I don't know what took me so long doing it. <laughs> just got in, done installing my reels. Installing my airline reel in my van and the beast. And got through uh, replacing this one because it doesn't reel in anymore. I don't like wasting a lot of time. So, bought me another one. And what that basically did, guys, excuse the rags, it got done wiping everything off and wiping all the soot off the side of the van that the equipment causes and all that stuff. I'm, I'm real particular about this van. I love my van, man. Wipe my equipment off. You can see my pressure wash is clean. My uh, generator is clean. My um, compressor is clean. But anyway, you guys, there it is. There it is. Pretty simple. Um, this one right here I got with tie downs, if you can see. Because it's light, this one here is real light. So uh, I, had, I, I, mean, I just took two tie downs and tied it down real good. Now this one on the other hand, it was, it, it, this bad boy here is heavy. And by the way, I got both of these at Harbor Freight. Uh, I was just out and about, my wife and I, I stopped by Harbor Freight. And I said, I'm gonna get them reels today after 18 years. <laughs> anyway, you notice my van got holes already in it. So that boat fits right in that hole right there. So. I guess you're saying to yourself, well, why do you need to tighten that thing all the way down? Because I want it to stay loose. Because I might want to go out my side over there and I need for this to swivel. That way. That way. So that's why I didn't tie it all the way down. It's not going to go anywhere. So I'm very proud of that, man. Um, looks good. Um, it'll make my job a lot easier. Uh, where when I get ready to go, instead of me having to wind or wrap everything up, you know, pull, goes back in. So, as you guys can see, uh, I forgot, total, I paid about 168 for both. So, you can kind of add those numbers up if you want. You can get them at Harbor Freight, uh, pretty uh, reasonable price. And uh, I get a chance to test them out in the morning. I got a hot rod from State Farm. Uh, I got him in the morning. I got another client on Saturday morning. I got her to do just to wash, and I'm going to call it call it a quits like I said uh, I do it part-time but make full-time money <laughs> ha, you got it. Well, anyway here's my old one man it just stopped reeling back in man it just done took the old army anthem <laughs> but I wiped everything down in my van and she's ready to go for tomorrow so to be real convenient guys you might want to purchase you some of these um, if you have a van or whatever, you probably can put it into a, one of those uh, caravans or, or astro vans. Uh, if you can install them, I mean, if there's a way to install them, you can install them. But anyway, man, a small video to show you guys how I updated the beast. Uh, nothing fancy. I wiped down the sides and stuff, all the sud that the exhaust blows off. I, I'm real particular about my van because this van has been real good to me. So take care of your van, man. And Actually, she's about to get an overhaul, man. I'm getting ready to go to the place. I'm going to have them replace all my rubber seal. See here? Begin to come off. Uh, I'm going to have them replace everything for me around the edges so it won't sort of leak on me. Um, I'm going to have to get it. Well, I don't have to, but I'm going to get it repainted. See here? This is what's happening on both sides, man. I I, I, I got to go down to Nissan tomorrow and let them know this don't supposed to be happening. You see? You see how that's it's right in the crevice. If I go on the other side, again, look at this. It, that, that don't supposed to happen. You see that? So they might fix it. <laughs> Even though it's in 2012, that, that, that don't supposed to happen there, Leroy. But anyway, man, that's what your boy been doing today. And just with me putting those reels up, man, I mean, it gives me a lot more space, man. As you can see here, you know, I mean, it still looks real neat, but I'm real particular, man. I got everything lined up, and here's my stool. I normally keep my stool in between the seats, and my gloves underneath the seat right here. And I got my big buffer right there, and my small buffer is on the other side over there, behind that uh, wheel. This over there. Uh, my tank. I got my supplies, you know, just in case I need some, right there in the door. Um... Try to make your job easier, you guys. You see my, my steam machine, it's right here in the middle. Um, 
it ain't really going nowhere. You see the tie downs, it's tied down to the straps. So you want to be able to get to what you want to get to without wasting a lot of time. 90% of the work for some people is looking for stuff. What the hell? I don't want to look for nothing, man. Unless it's the wife when she's cooking dinner. Hey, what the hell in that kitchen, girl? <laughs> but anyway, there you go, guys. All installed by your boy EQ. All right, man, y'all be cool, small video, man. If you can upgrade your stuff, like I tell you, upgrade your stuff. When you start making your money, don't go out there and waste it. Upgrade your stuff. Make your business look like you are serious. You heard? And how? You there. All right, man, y'all be cool. Deuces.